Hey guys, so it's time to do a battery endurance test and heat test on some of the best phones you can buy right now. So we do have XZ Premium, uh, Xiaomi Mi 6, S8, OnePlus 5 and the HTC U11 flagship. So a nice uh, flock of phones here, all with the most up-to-date processors, uh, which uh, you know handles the heat and battery endurance. That is what I wanted to find out here. Uh, so we're just going to see what the starting temperature is on all of them uh, so we can see you know how they do run uh, so if we just open up the CPU temperature you can actually see what uh, they're running at at the moment uh, so you can see I think uh, they're running quite cool all of them are fully charged to the uh, max here and have about 70% uh, screen brightness, auto sync is on, etc. So quite realistic conditions. I think the OnePlus 5 is actually running the coolest here, starting off, so it's quite nice because you are using the dash charging as well. So, uh, in fact, I don't think it's actually dash charging at the moment because it's connected to a power bank, so uh, that, uh, you know, uh, isn't in effect because it usually has a blue light, but nevertheless, let's see. Uh, if uh, we can see who has the best battery endurance. I'm going to do it a little bit different this time. We don't have uh, asphalt, but we do have an Antutu uh, tester here, which apparently tests the battery life. So that could be uh, something good here. So we'll just open up all of them. And you can see we have quite a few tests that you can run on here. So we're going to be doing the battery one. And the Mi 6, is it going to load it? Yes, it is. So we're just going to unplug them now, all about the same time. So it's fair. There we go. And let's go to start. So we're going to basically do it until about 50%. So that might take quite a while. Uh, and then we can definitely see who has the best battery life. So let's go, 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 go. So yeah, I'm going to obviously resume the video later uh, when we see you know what's happened, and uh, you know so I think it's going to be quite interesting. Uh, my money is probably on the HTC U11 or the Mi 6, but we'll see. You know, we'll see who is going to win. Hey guys, so I just wanted to do a quick update video here. I think I've left them for about an hour or so, uh, and we can see that the uh, Sony seems to be uh, like draining the fastest here along with the HTC. Uh, it is a quite a thorough test actually. It tests everything like the browser, the gaming, etc. So it's pretty awesome uh, test here. I'm not sure why I didn't find it before, but you can see uh, the OnePlus 5 seems to be doing the best here, uh, holding at 79%. Uh, and the HTC doing the worst so I think uh, the HTC is nearly at the 50% level and then we'll finish uh, as well as the Sony uh, we will carry on until uh, you know where we get them to about the desired level but this is basically how it is uh, an hour later so uh, the S8 is also doing quite well obviously 76% and uh, the Mi 5 uh, doing uh, third best here, so quite interesting results, but we'll just let them carry on here. So the XE Premium and the HCC U11 seem to have finished up here, and as you can see, uh, they are getting uh, 6,058 for the U11 and 7,100. 101 11. so yeah I think the XC premium and the U11 uh, have uh, basically come last here in this test which is quite surprising to me 
because uh, I thought that the uh, U11 would be pretty good when it comes to the battery, like sense sense seems to be, you know, well optimized, etc. So uh, the others are still going here, which I'm probably going to leave them carrying on until they finish, uh, and then we're going to see what their scores are. But quite interesting, nevertheless. You know, HCC used to be pretty good when it came to the battery, but clearly not and maybe it's the 4k kind of display here on the Sony uh, which is causing uh, you know a little bit rapid battery drain uh, but we'll keep them going nevertheless and see how the other three do okay so they're all finished now and we can see who is the winner uh, so you can see the winner is clearly the OnePlus uh, 5 here on the right with 9681 uh, it took the longest to go through the test and has only just finished actually. Uh, the second best, the Galaxy S8, very impressive given that it has a smaller battery. And then the Mi 6 came third, uh, the XE Premium obviously, and then the U11. So I'm very surprised actually with these results because I, as I said I was expecting either uh, the Mi 6 or the uh, U11 to dominate but obviously not so you know props where props is due here uh, when it comes to the uh, OnePlus 5 phone it does have a pretty good battery life it seems uh, overall and I'll probably do some other tests as well uh, in fact let's just see the heat as well see if we can see there's any heating uh, so let's just get this up on all of them still got some weird music coming from one of the phones even though the test is done so you can see the OnePlus seems to be running pretty cool but the U11 is probably running the coolest here which is good uh, but the battery life doesn't seem to be very impressive. So yeah, just a quick little video battery test here. Hope uh, that helps anyone out there who's looking at these handsets for, you know, something which is going to last you. And uh, certainly we do some other videos, so do stay tuned for that. And I'll see you in the next one.